Hi everybody, it's me, Samantha. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to share with you guys a coloring book haul from Amazon that I got in the mail the last few days. And yeah, so grab a drink and a snack and I hope you guys enjoy this video. I did get a couple new books in the mail and um, they are right here. So I wanted to share them with you guys. The first book that I got was Adorable Things by Southern Lotus. This is a very cutesy type of book. It is a matte cover, which I really like. I love the bright colors of, of it. It just really called out to me, and I picked it up. Um, so I did... We'll do a flip through of it here. I did um, color a page in it already, so you will see that. And I'll share that with you at the end of the month wrap-up here. Is the this book belongs to page it's just really cute like different types of things like little creatures and little food and stuff like that I love anime stuff I think it's really pretty and I love coloring it so yeah I thought I would just pick this book up not that I need any more books but it is what it is um, this is the first page that I colored and I chose to do these colors with it um, I think it turned out okay. It could have been a little bit better, in my opinion, if I would have tried a little bit harder. Um, I just kind of threw color at the page, and that's how it turned out. So this is a ramen page, it looks like, with little creatures and a little happy bowl. And I like it. So yeah, this uh, this page is... Looks like a little bottle with some clouds and stuff. I don't really know what this is. Do you guys think it's like a bear or a cat? I don't know. It looks kind of like both to me. And it's the same creature that's throughout the book, so. <laughs> that's cute. I just like coloring these types of pages because it makes me happy. Super cute. Oh, it's a cat. Okay. I see. I see its little toe beans. I think this was like $7.99 or something like that on Amazon if you guys are curious. I'll leave a link in the description below. So how are you guys doing? It's the end of the week. Thank goodness. This was a weird week. I don't know what it was, but I was just kind of all over the place. Everything just kind of kept going wonky and my allergies have been really bad this week. So I've been kind of trying to stay inside. It hasn't really been working too well because I've of course had to take my son to school and back and just run errands and stuff. And then I had a doctor's appointment in Spokane that actually went really well. Um, I really, I went to go see a specialist for some of my arthritis pain in my hip. And I'm gonna try a new medication. So hopefully, fingers crossed, it's gonna help. He said he could do an injection on my hip, but I don't like needles and I'm afraid of them. So I don't really wanna do that. Unless I have to. And I'm only 37, you guys. So I'm almost 40, but I don't, I just don't want to do the injections yet. I don't know. He, he recommended that I see a naturopath for the fibromyalgia. And so I'm going to do that. But we don't have, so where I live in North Idaho, we don't have very many specialists, which is mind boggling to me because it's like, where do all the people go that have issues and need help? Because I'm sure there's more people than me, you know, that have arthritis and stuff. And I don't know. It just might, there's like no arthritis specialist in North Idaho. Here's the back. Anyway, I'm glad I found a really nice doctor that actually listened to me. Because half the time they don't. They just say I'm 
overweight and need to lose weight and that'll fix everything. The next book that I picked up was Mosaic Art Landscapes, the three millimeter by such and such diva. I have not colored anything in here yet because I'm scared to, to be honest. Um, I've seen some pictures done already and they look beautiful. I think Anne colored one from A Colorful Life. But yeah, I'm not going to do a full flip because this is what the pages look like. And you can kind of see, I think, what some of them are going to turn out to be. But I think that this will be good. It just, this one's going to take me a minute to work my courage up to, so to speak. But yeah. The next book I picked up is Winged Magic by Selena Fenich. And this is what her art looks like. It's very beautiful. Ooh, I want to color this page. That's pretty. Mostly I do her work in pencils, but that's cute. I want to color this one too. Her work is also intimidating to me for some reason. I just don't ever feel like I do it justice. Ooh, that's so pretty. I've been really into like the fantasy and fairy stuff all of a sudden. So I've gotten some new books with that in it. And also the steampunk again. I went through a phase a couple years ago where I was super into steampunk. I have a couple books, but not a whole lot. And I like the dragons. I'm just not super into dragons. But this one is so cute. The little baby. Look at him. So yeah, maybe I'll color a page on camera next month. I'm kind of burnt out right now because I colored a lot. And I say that every month, but... This month I do feel like I did a lot of buddy colors and I did a lot of um, just pages in general that I'm kind of burnt out on. So Ooh, I like that one. That one's cool. So yeah, it's just been a weird week. And my allergies have been all over the place because we had some smoke come down for the from wildfires in Canada, I guess. But that's not making things better. Um, the next book that I picked up was Steampunk Fairies and Baby Dragons. I just thought this looked really cute. Super dark pages, but I really like that because it's different. This is by, did I say who this was by? No, I didn't. Color Chase. Color Castle. Not Color Chase. I just think these pages are really cute. She doesn't look too happy. What have you guys been into coloring lately? I seem to be kind of turning a page and I'm getting more into the fantasy steampunk section of things again. 
And I've been coloring a lot of mermaids this month, probably because of mermaid. But I do have quite a bit of those pictures. I did finish a coloring book this month, which I'm really pleased with. I was feeling kind of, I don't know, down about it at the beginning of the year because I don't feel like I've colored, finished any books and it's May. And I feel like I usually finish at least a book by now, or at least by March. Pretty. I like that one. I just like how dark these pictures are. It's going to be pretty both ways with pencils and markers in the test pages. Okay, so there's the back of that. So this one is Steampunk Fairies and Baby Dragons. The next one I picked up is Fairies 3 by Christine Karen. Those of you that are familiar with her work know what her work looks like. I have quite a few of her books. And some duplicate pages, it looks like. So that's good. Oh, this one's pretty. I like this one. Cute. Looks like she's got some new ones mixed in with the old ones in this book. Ooh, that one's pretty. Ooh, I like that one too. Oh, that one's going to be cute for Halloween. I can't wait to color that one. That one's pretty too for Christmas. I've never seen that one before. I just really love her work. Okay, what other books does she have? I have this one, this one, this one, and this one. I don't have that guy or these ones. I need to get these ones. So yeah, there is a Fairies 3. And the last one that I picked up this month was Beautiful Fairies and Elves by Selena. Or no, this is not Selena Finish. This is Two Paths Publishing. So pretty. I just saw this cover just caught my eye and I had to get it. So gorgeous. Oh my gosh. So pretty. I've been getting a little bit more confident and used to coloring in the gray scale as well. So it just takes some time to get used to, I think. For me, it took a long time because I wasn't very confident in myself. So. I like this one. Ooh, 
Ooh, I like this one too. Ooh, and I like this one. I like them all. Ooh, that one's pretty. pictures to color next month. Oh my goodness. I have some new books that I'm excited to color in. Maybe I'll start one of these pages on camera. I like doing faces. Do you guys like coloring faces? Oh, I think these are duplicate pages. Oh, uh, maybe not. I've been really liking how Grace has been coloring her faces lately. If you don't know who Grace is, definitely check her out. She's Grace's Coloring Corner on YouTube. And I just really like watching her videos. So anyway, that's my coloring book haul for this month. Hope you guys liked it. Please like and subscribe to the channel. If you are new, hit that notification bell to get all of my uploads. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.